Number 7. Consider two displacements, one of magnitude 3 meters and another of magnitude 4 meters. Show how the displacement vectors may be combined to get a resultant displacement of magnitude letter A 7 meters, letter B 1 meter and letter C 5 meters. So let's say that this one is our first displacement, let's call it vector A and this is our second displacement so it's longer let's call it vector b so in letter a we want uh, to combine the vector so we get a seven meters displacement so we have three meters over here and four meters for letter b so this is the absolute value so it's pretty simple to see you just align them pointing in the same direction so if you do this you have 3 meters over here 4 meters over here so you would get 7 meters over here so this is the answer of letter A you just align them parallel to each other so this is the answer of letter A for letter B you want 1 meter so you have to go let's say to the right with vector B and to the left with vector A so the resultant is this vector which has a magnitude of only one meter so this is the answer of letter B you have to align them and parallel so this is letter B for letter C you just have to align them perpendicular to each other so let's say this is our vector vector B, this is our vector A, so this is 4 meters, this is 3 meters, and this is 5 meters, so 5 meters. So this is the famous triangle 3, 4, 5, so this is the answer of letter C.